Scorpio, what's up? Welcome to my channel. Am I tripping or not tarot? My name is Cockfrost, but you can call me the ghetto nun. So Scorpio, I'm here to do your July slash general slash love reading, my G. I do cuss in my readings and give no fucks about it. So if you do, please get the fuck on. I do start all of my cards upright in my deck. I don't believe in starting out with reversals because that's some bullshit. Also, I did pre-shuffle Scorpio, but I did not lay any cards down just yet. We're going to do it together. Please keep in mind this may or may not resonate with every single Scorpio. Getting no fit nuts. Info for private readings will be below the video. Please take the time to check out our community board. It's like the farmer's market for all the nuns and high priests where they have their businesses, purposes, gifts, etc., etc. posted. If you'd like to submit your business for the bulletin board, please check the info in the description box below the video. It is currently under construction. If you find that the convent is not for you, please look for the nearest exit mark. Get the fuck on. Watch head on the way out. Hit that alley. You'll be back in Terrellin. Thank you to everyone for all the bookings, donations, likes, subscribes, comments, shares, purchases to my website, and pledges to my Patreon. I love you. Scorpio, what's up, G? I feel like exhausted, Scorpio. Like, not like me personally doing your reading. Well, yes, because I just started it, but the energy I'm picking up from you or someone else is exhausted. Somebody may not be sleeping, Scorpio, okay? This could be from being out partying or going here and there. This could be travel. This could be jet lag or a time difference if you guys have been traveling from place to place to place, Scorpio. It could be something like that. But something about exhausted or the exhaust because they're showing me someone's car now. Uh, someone's car may uh, break down uh, Scorpio. I see exhaust or some fumes or some smoke coming out of some shit, okay? Yeah. Or you guys are just exhausted, like, like tired, but it's going to have an effect on you emotionally, Scorpio. Or this is somebody else. Like somebody may be uh, overdoing something, Scorpio, where it's going to take a toll on them. <clears throat> on their body, their face. So somebody needs a break. Libra kind of had the same thing. Uh, so you could be a Libra Scorpio cusper or have Libra in your chart somewhere, Scorpio. Yeah, somebody uh, already knows this though. They don't care. Somebody's just like fucking they body up, Scorpio. Like, oh well, you know, like, uh, okay. It's definitely a water sign doing this. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, okay? Somebody may be going through, like, depression or something, Scorpio, so they overindulge and all this other shit. I don't know, Scorpio. Let's get started. I don't want to just harp on just all negative, like, intuitive messages. Like, let's just stop right there, okay? This could be somebody else, Scorpio. Whoever this is doing this, they put up a good front, though. You wouldn't know. Like, when you see this person out, they, they laugh, they smile, they're dressed well. People are gathered around this person. This person could be singing, dancing, or whatever the fuck it is. But it's like they're on autopilot or something. Like, it's like they're running on fumes. They keep saying exhaust and fumes. So, shit, I don't know. Somebody could be huffing and shit. I don't even know if people still do that shit, but that's what they said. Someone huffs. Okay. Some of y'all know what that means, some of y'all don't. I don't want to explain it to put nothing in nobody's head, but yeah, something's like, somebody's on drugs out here too, uh, Scorpio, okay? Give me some messages for Scorpio in July. All right, you got the sun and the chariot. So that number one, this is happening right now. This is my uh, cancer card uh, going into Leo. So then the next, like this month and the next two months, Scorpio, this reading will pertain to you. So basically I ain't got to record shit for you for August is what they saying. I'm just kidding, I will. But that they're saying, so I guess this reading will pertain to the next reading that I do for you in August. That's number one. That's also happiness. That's also knowing where you're going. Those two, uh, the sun with the chariot is like knowing where you're going or shit. Someone's going to be exposed at their job or someone's being followed. Uh, Scorpio, it could be a cancer or a Leo involved in this. You could have cancer or Leo in your chart. Yeah, but shit, this is a bowl of no fucks given and shit. So that's why I said somebody's like just empty. So did they put on this face like, yeah, so this could be somebody having a great job or this, somebody could be sick. You know what I mean? And not telling anybody. But so when they go to work or they go around people, they act like shit ain't happening. But it really is like somebody's like numb out here in Scorpio. I told you it's a water sign. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, heavy on the cancer could be a Leo. But somebody out here is like fronting, G. <clears throat> yeah, it's shady. I knew it. It's not the real chariot. 
this is like a front uh, here, Scorpio. You or someone else is putting it up, but it's to hide like some type of feeling or something like that. Or something that someone's going through. It's like to, uh, someone wants to act like something's not affecting them, Scorpio, and it is, G. Okay? I feel like some people see through this or see this. With the sun and the chariot, some people see what's going on. Or you see what's going on with someone. Uh, even if they do show up like that. Somebody can read somebody very well. You could be a reader, a tarot reader, a psychic or something. Uh, Scorpio or just intuitive or tapped in or some shit. Give me another one here for Scorpio. Somebody has somebody named Uncle Polly. Somebody has an Uncle Polly. <laughs> Only because what's beef is playing in the back with Biggie. And that's, I just heard Uncle Polly. So somebody got one. There you are, Scorpio. Boom, tower card. <clears throat> you got all major arcana. You got the sun chariot with the tower. So somebody's about to see something happen. Okay, this is like about to see something extraordinary happen or see someone crash. This could be like crash out as far as like they, buy, you know, somebody just pass out on stage. It's like this type of shit. Exhaustion, heat exhaustion is what I'm picking up as well, Scorpio. I feel like someone needs to lay it on the fuck down. It could definitely be you, a Cancer or a Leo. Somebody's, uh, I see a car accident out here, Scorpio, but it's like because someone is like driving and they're tired, G. So be careful if you're driving like across states or, you know what I mean, just been on the road a long time and you start getting delirious, somebody needs to pull over, Scorpio. Like I keep getting sleep deprivation. So somebody could be doing drugs to stay up. You know what I mean? But they're really not up and shit. They're not in their right mind. It's like the drugs are keeping them up. You know what I mean? They're not uh, like thinking clearly or some shit like that. You or somebody else in July. And it's damn sure July and August here. This is like seeing a crash or something crashing or exploding or blowing up. It could be a career blowing up. You know what I mean? Where something goes viral, Scorpio. Like, you know, I'm about to blow up. Like, you know, career taking off and shit just real good. But not with this at the bottom, G. Or it could be. This could be like, uh, this giving me award energy. Like, people get nominated and you waiting to see if they call your name, Scorpio, to see if you got it. It could be something like that or a cross watcher. This is also waiting on the birth of a baby, the birth of a son. Somebody's gonna be surprised that they're having a son. Congratulations uh, is what this is as well. <clears throat> so maybe you're up all night or for days while someone is in labor, Scorpio, or you are the one in labor here. And it's like, man, I can't wait to just go to sleep, crash out, like I'm tired, I just wanna go home. Uh, it's something like that. Something about either like your body is just like ready to lay it all down or some shit like that, Scorpio, or somebody's just, or there's an accident out here. Oh, wait. Let's see. Yeah, there is. Some of y'all, it's a driver that falls asleep behind the wheel of a car, okay? <clears throat> or they pass out. Someone passes out behind the wheel of a car, but this person is sick. Uh, this person is, is very pale and clammy and cold when the ambulance gets to this person. So somebody could have a stroke or a heart attack or something behind the wheel, Scorpio. Something like that, okay? So be careful. If you're just not feeling well or you feel like you shouldn't be driving, don't do it. Something about fires. <clears throat> it is fire season where we live in Los Angeles and shit. Or it's about to be. But something about fire season and the air quality, Scorpio, or cross watcher, okay? Or just be careful of fires, explosion. Uh, I'm hearing uh, carbon monoxide. Like exhaust. They keep showing me like fumes from a car. So I don't know what's going on. Uh, or just, I don't know. Some about check your carbon monoxide uh, detectors, y'all. And make sure they're working because I'm picking up on that heavily, Okay. I'm not picking up someone's doing this purpose purposefully. Doctor Strange, who had that shit? <clears throat> uh, and I was telling them they needed to go to the doctor. I don't remember. It might have been Sagittarius. I think that's who it was. You could be a Scorpio Sagittarius cusper here, uh, Scorpio. Uh, this says uh, intention is the gateway to glory. Is what this says. So, shit. I mean, somebody could be acting weird, G. 
Doctor Strange is what this says. We're behind the wheel. This could be an Uber driver, Lyft driver, taxi. Pay attention. I don't know what they what they they operate. Somebody out here operates some machinery, and they don't look good, G. Pay attention, or this you, Scorpio. Somebody does not look good behind the. Uh, this could be a firearm as well, or something. This is also the police pulling someone over for drinking and driving. Somebody swerving all in the road or something like that, Scorpio. They may not even be drinking and driving. Somebody either either has like some type of medical uh, emergency behind the wheel or somewhere out in public where they just pass the fuck out or they're drinking and driving or something's going on with somebody, G. Somebody is going to do something that alarms people, Scorpio. Or someone's doing something that's alarming people where someone's like, something's wrong with this motherfucker, G. Squirrel girl. Yeah, they could be moving real fast or running. It feel like drugs, G. It feel like drugs to me. But it says, when the wilderness calls, I listen. This could be somebody missing. You know what I mean? Like just wandering the streets or something. Some, I mean, somebody could have a mental breakdown, Scorpio, is what this feels like as well. Maybe Dr. Strange could be like a therapist or some type of mental facility, you know, where doctors deal with people who have, you know, strange things going on in their mind. Someone could be seeing a therapist or something like that. Uh, or they need to or else they are going to explode or something will happen. It's like somebody can only take so much or someone's body or mind or something can only take so much, Scorpio. Fuck. Yeah, you could be traveling a lot. It could be like a just wear and tear. What are, yeah, exhaustion, they keep saying. This is uh, Jay-Z, girls, girls, girls. But he was talking about how he traveled from place to place to place and met different women from different races, ethnicities, and all that. So some of y'all could just do a lot of traveling for work or shit. You, you date a lot or something. But somebody is like running on fumes, G. That's literally what they're saying. They keep saying running on fumes or exhausted. <clears throat> Damn sure something about heat exhaustion. Somebody may be visiting a volcano or an island and shit where there's a volcano there. It's some type of, uh, it's some type of, I don't feel like the volcano's gonna erupt or anything, but it's something about some ancestors or some, like, guides or something. They said you need to respect them and bring an offering. I don't know. I heard Kilimanjaro. So I don't know. I know that's, I'm probably saying it wrong. Mount Kilimanjaro, they said. Somebody wants to climb that or hike that. You need to bring an offering and pay respects, they said. Whoever shit. Okay. Not the mountain guy. Uh, banged on y'all's ass. What the hell? I don't know. It's making me feel like, <clears throat> I don't know. A lot of people have died on that mountain, but they're showing me like some ancient something. I don't know. Okay. Whoever's climbing that shit or going around that area, you need to pay homage or something to them people. Okay. Ooh -wee. Somebody is driving up a mountain though. I don't know where this mountain is. Just be careful. Scorpio or Crosswatcher driving fast. It could be a windy road like Mulholland and Skirball. If you live in Los Angeles, you know, like, you know, it's real dark or some shit like that. Somebody could be driving real fast. Uh, somebody out here is like reckless. Like, I don't know if somebody's wanting to hurt themselves. Uh, you know what I mean? Like, they just do stupid shit. Like, mm -hmm. put something on the tower. Be careful with this person, Scorpio, okay? It's like somebody who doesn't really value their life, but they pretend like they do. But, like, if you get alone with this person or you get to spend some time with this person, you could tell something's going on with them and they're a danger to themselves and other people. It just doesn't, they don't come off like that. Damn. Rogue and Gambit. Damn. Who else had, damn, somebody had this. Cancer. Yeah. Cancer had this. They had uh, somebody so thirsty they could drink a lake. So make sure you stay hydrated, uh, Scorpio, because I don't feel like you're thirsty or nothing. But remember I said something about heat exhaustion and all this other shit and somebody sleeping with a bunch of people and travel. That's what this shit is, G. Be careful. Some of y'all, uh, on a good note, Scorpio, are about to end up in a relationship or somebody trying to destroy your relationship. I can't tell. For those that aren't in a relationship, this is like a surprise. Like, surprise, like you, you know, booed up, you know what I mean, this summer. If you're in a relationship, there's somebody trying to fuck your shit up, Scorpio. It could be another Scorpio, Cancer, Leo doing this, or you're doing this to somebody's, like, relationship. 
or somebody's acting weird around somebody that they like or love. It could be that too. Like somebody's acting all awkward, like they do dumb shit when they like people. You know, Scorpio, this could be uh, some shit where somebody likes you and they never call you. Or someone wants to date you, so they date someone else. It's like, I'll show you how much I love you. I'm going to fuck someone else, Scorpio. This this type of like a strange ass weird motherfucker. Somebody has some uh strange love language out here in Scorpio. Okay, they do the exact opposite in regards to when they like you or you do this shit. So it's like, no, when I really love somebody, I ignore them, says this person. What? You're destroying a relationship. You're not building it. Maybe somebody uh, somebody out here likes to play games, Scorpio. Somebody likes to be chased here, especially with this chariot here. Uh, someone likes for the woman to chase. Uh, this man do look a little feminine and shit. You know what I mean? Look how he kissing and shit. She look more masculine than him. I feel like somebody expects some woman, a man expects the woman to chase them. And I feel like she like, that's real Dr. Strange. I don't do that shit. Okay. Uh, you could be a Cancer Leo woman saying that shit or a Scorpio woman or ho however this goes. But some shit like that, okay? Somebody's weird. Yeah, uh, who just had this? Damn, remember you repeating people shit. Capricorn had this and it was giving me Leo energy and Leo is out here. This is like somebody who's very egotistical out here. Somebody ego about to get blown to smithers. Somebody may actually, it could be something Scorpio where somebody like wanted you to chase them and they're realizing you're not doing this shit, right? This is somebody I feel like is in love with your ass, Scorpio, or you're in love with somebody. And I feel like you wanted somebody to, like, express their love first or vice versa, whoever this. Somebody wanted someone to express their love first and chase after them. And somebody like, I think the fuck not. I don't do that shit, right? And so that person moved the fuck on. Whoever wanted somebody to chase after them and all this other shit is, like, in love, like, love sick. That's what this is, too, love sick over somebody. This person may actually break uh, Scorpio and maybe like, fuck it, I love you then. You know what I mean? Fuck it, you're the one. Uh, even though they wanted the other person to chase and, and tell them they love them first, somebody uh, can't handle it. Somebody's about to break out here, uh, Scorpio. Now, that's in regards to a love situation, which sounds a lot better because it's like the motherfucker playing games is the one who really in love. That's the person that's going to end up just spilling their guts and shit. Like, I'm in love, I love, right? This type of shit. And I feel like these two people end up getting together, Scorpio, on some real shit. Uh, but whoever someone wants, whoever wants someone to chase them, it doesn't go that way. Uh, the person who wants someone to chase them ends up becoming the chaser themselves. And they, they like tell you that they love you, Scorpio, or you do this shit. Okay. That's in regards to a love situation. If that's not the case, this like somebody chasing a high. Okay. Or trying to, it's something they'll never get though. You know what I mean? When they say you chase a high, it's you trying to chase the first one that you had. Uh, or the second, maybe third. You know what I mean? But after a while, you don't get high like that. So then you're chasing that high, that same high. So somebody keeps doing more and more and more. Someone's putting a lot of wear and tear on their body. Uh, and their body can't handle it, Scorpio. Okay? I see two people fucking in a car. I've been picking that up a lot. This is a small-ass car, too. I feel like these two people tall. In this small ass vehicle. I feel like it's a rental. I don't know why, but I do. But I guess that's the end. This feel like an affair. Because it say let love in. Like that's the only time. Ooh. Somebody come home acting weird. Doctor Strange, where you been? Why you acting so weird? Because they was just fucking somebody in the car down the street. Ooh, wait. Somebody is not a good. Somebody can't hide something, Scorpio. That's why I said if somebody on drugs or exhausted or some shit like that, people are picking up on it because someone's acting strange. If someone's like in love with someone, love sick, and they acting like they're not, people can tell because this person's acting strange. If someone's uh, having an affair and then when they come home to come and lay next to their spouse, the spouse can tell because they acting strange, dude. Somebody's like out of acting out of character or they will in July. Like something comes to a complete like end uh in july possibly into august though uh scorpio y'all may try to drag this out into scorpio season this could be like some drama that drag all the way the fuck out like you know what i mean somebody just push push that shit you know like so somebody that was just sneaking out in the car and shit now they sneaking somebody in the house you know what i mean like somebody's like up in the ante here uh scorpio to where shit just gonna be a disaster for that fuck ass shit it is Ooh, we Scorpio. Y'all shit always juicy, though. It is. I actually love reading for y'all. For us, they. Cause we, cause we. Yeah, but I don't resonate with this shit. Fucking in cars and exhausting my body. I don't know. I believe in naps. 
Uh, you know what I mean? I believe in water, staying in the shade, um, all types of shit. Okay. Mm -mm. Put some on Doctor Strange here with the uh, chariot sun. Uh, November seventh could be significant. November fourth, November third, uh, March the fourth, March eleventh could be significant. Can uh, Cancer, yes, but uh, July the eleventh could be significant too. Uh, Scorpio, these dates or something like that. Somebody could like to wear Levi's as well. Put something on, or someone's name is Levi. Put something on Doctor Strange with the chariot, son. The hangman, Pisces energy out here. Yeah, somebody gets stopped by the police. Chariot, they do. You've been you've been driving strange, sir, ma'am. Acting strange or something. Somebody swerving or something out here. Heavy Pisces, Cancer, Leo energy out here. About to get pulled over by the ones. They are. Somebody's car does stop, I told you. Some exhaust or something like that, or it just stalls. This is like a car stalling out, overheating. Uh, this is giving me overheating energy here, Scorpio, as well. It's definitely happening to a man or a masculine energy because there's apples here. Whenever I see apples, that's Adam's apple, or someone's name is Adam, or someone's own Adam. Shit, if you live out here, this could be happening on Adam's, G. Uh... It's pretty well. That's a wide street. I guess it's okay to break. I mean, depending on what part of Adams you break down on, it ain't the best street. Side note, or someone's last name is Adams, or someone just creepy and shit, like Adams family. You know, someone could be into like, you know, some weird ass shit. Somebody could have stopped coming towards somebody too, uh, Scorpio, because you are into esoteric things or taboo things, tarot, you know, spirituality. It could be something like that. Uh, someone, Dr. Strange, it's like someone stopped coming towards somebody. Or someone told someone to stop coming towards somebody because of some difference between you and someone else. And this person is in love with you, Scorpio. So somebody could have told somebody, no, nah, don't go towards that person. They do this. Scorpio does that. Scorpio does this. Or they only, you know, they drive the hamster car. And you, you know, it's like this type of shit. And you play the piano in the dark. Like, no, <laughs> you know, somebody could have wanted you, Scorpio, or someone else to not go towards someone and like, made someone look really bad or appear to be looking very, very bad uh, to someone. And I feel like somebody still goes towards the other person, G. That GTA. Because the boys, somebody's still in cars and shit? <laughs> what? Wow. Yeah, something about Grand Theft Auto or you could be playing the video game. For some reason, you got to stop it. You smell smoke. Uh, I don't know, Scorpio. Somebody is, is mm -hmm. like somebody zoned out. So this could be somebody playing video games and forget they cooking shit and shit catch on fire, G. Because it's all about making that GTA. Uh, I don't know. Some about video games or something. Mm -hmm. This could be your kids. Them burnt some shit or they will. You know they home this summer while you at work. Chariot card. Uh, got little girls and boys over and shit in their room and talking about they gonna cook something and they start kissing and forget shit boiling. That's what this shit is, Scorpio. Ooh -wee. I feel like you're more responsible than that. So this is giving me teenager uh, kid energy, you know? Ooh -wee. You gonna be mad when you get home? Tower car, boom. Judgment, yeah, be done kill one of them damn kids. Ooh, I'm gonna put that back just because I can feel your anger. Uh, somebody damn near burned down the house, and I feel like they lie about it because what they gonna say, I had a boy in my room or a girl in my room or some shit like that. Sorry with the fireworks and shit. Uh, they're not gonna say that. You still gonna yell at them whatever lie they tell you, but you're gonna be like, boy, girl, you trying to burn my house? This type of shit. Maybe it's fireworks. Shit. Uh, on some dry ass grass and shit. You just happen to come home, gonna burn the damn house down. It's not funny, but I hope that that's okay, Scorpio. Let me uh, close the window so it's not too loud. I'm sorry. I mean, it ain't my fault, but did I do that? Yeah, mystical. Is what I heard. It's too much. Yeah, somebody could, uh, yeah, some of you guys are, like, into, like, you know, 
your uh, star seeds and all that shit, indigo children, healers and all that shit, kind of like a uh, eccentric people, Scorpio or cross watcher. And I feel like someone tried to stay away from you or was told to stay away from you because of that. And somebody can't stay away from you, Scorpio, or you can't stay away from somebody. Somebody's going to end up like saying something or doing something. Somebody could write a song for somebody as well. Uh, Scorpio or serenade somebody uh, some shit have a whole band show up I don't know mariachi I heard the mariachi band comes and sings for somebody somebody's gonna like express something somebody's either gonna like uh, like I said pass out from all these drugs and all this other shit where it's like it's obvious this person's it's a cry for help right it's gonna be something like that or something's gonna explode with this third party and this affair and people driving down the street in cars and sleeping with each other. Something's gonna come to a head where somebody is not gonna be able to deal with this third party for long. Or this is like someone who was kept away from you, Scorpio, or Cross Watcher uh, because of something else. They were scared of you, uh, people scared them away from you or some shit like that, and somebody's gonna say something. In regards to that situation, that may not happen till Scorpio season. Somebody just gonna be lovesick all motherfucking summer and most of the fall, okay? So probably for the next four months, somebody just gonna be drooling over your ass, Scorpio, or you will be drooling over somebody till somebody can't take it no more, basically. Put one on Rogue and Gambit left love in now. I don't have your energy out here, Scorpio, but we damn sure got the devil, and he is not welcome here. Capricorn energy, which I said, mm-hmm. The devil gets blown. There's a toxic relationship here, a karmic relationship that gets blown to fucking smithers. So if somebody uh, has a karmic soulmate, that shit's about to be over, Scorpio. If you're in a relationship with a karmic uh, energy, that shit's a wrap. Somebody gonna end up tripping, okay? Or something gets blown out of proportion or some sexual shit go real awry or somebody catch somebody in bed with another man or another woman or some shit like that, okay? There's something definitely scandalous going on here. Okay, I told you if it's that damn affair, that shit don't end up good, okay? I told you if it's drugs and alcohol or uh, some shit, that don't end up good. Not with the devil. Somebody just pass out. Somebody could get an STD from being very promiscuous, sleeping around with a bunch of people. It's like something comes to a halt here, uh, Scorpio, as well. Yeah, it's something somebody can't fight. Nine of Wands or is it seven? Seven of Wands, still same thing. Seven of Wands, reverse. Yeah, it's something somebody can't defend anymore or uh, keep hitting or uh, their body can't fight it anymore. This could be a virus or some shit like that or some type of infection. It's like somebody's just going to keep going or it's someone's heart. You know what I mean? As far as it's someone's love sick, they can't take it anymore. They must have someone. Like, I can't fight the feeling no more. Like, I got to go get it. I got to have it, uh, is what this person is saying. Now, it could be shit, drugs, like I said. Scorpio. They keep saying exhaust and fumes. What does that mean? <laughs> Sorry, no. I'll just be having ass shit, Scorpio. Yeah, somebody moving way too fast. That's uh, what this is. Queen of Wands usually moves confidently. She's beautiful, inspiring, uh, motivated, dedicated and shit. Will be the first one to get out there and all this. That's why I said somebody running themselves ragged though. Uh, uh, or somebody starts acting erratic. There's the wild horse, the belligerent horse again. So like I said, somebody could be on drugs and shit and they just start acting crazy or someone's acting weird. You know what I mean? They can't tame themselves. This could be that third party where somebody then, you know what I mean? They can't hold back no more. It's something like that. Where it's too hard to keep up some, some type of facade in regards to a love situation. They want the person they want or their body cannot keep up with this traveling or this drug and alcohol abuse or some shit like that or some of y'all wondering why somebody stopped coming towards you scorpio or you're one or someone else cross watcher they got with somebody uh, a karmic situation and they fucked they ass up or it's about to uh i don't know if you want this person back because I feel like this person is just going to keep doing the same thing. Whoever this is, I'm telling you, it's like not until they get like burn out. Yes. Whoever this is does not stop until they burn out, G. Okay. And that's not a good thing. You know, most people know to pull over. You know, who wants to drive a car until it runs out of gas? We don't need, even like for the light to be on E. It's like, no, I don't even like for it to get to a quarter of a tank before I, you know, like we do preventative shit. 
This is somebody who doesn't, they're uh, more reactive than proactive and shit. So it take a disease or whoever it is they really want to get with somebody else and shit for them to want to now be with that person. And you know what I mean? They got to pass out before, you know what I mean? They really start drinking water after the doctor told them your kidneys are, you know what I mean? Not doing what, it's like this type of shit. Like, it's like somebody just keeps going and going and going. Heavy Scorpio, Capricorn, Cancer, Leo, Pisces energy out here. Okay? I don't know, uh, Scorpio. That's been your reading, G. Like I said, it may or may not have resonated with that. That's the only way they said they could stop the devil. Yeah, whatever this is, it has to be that way because someone is, like, not getting clues or hints. Like, this shit's fucking shit up. Oh, hey, Scorpio. Like I said, it may or may not have resonated with every single Scorpio. Still, thank you for visiting my channel. Am I tripping or not? Tarot, my name is Cockfrost, but you can call me the ghetto nun. Please hit like, subscribe, share with your friends. Again, info for private readings will be below the video. You can purchase your DU gear and your tune-in deck at theghetto nun.com. And I will talk to you later. I love you. Bye.